started when I was 12 years old. I, I wanted to play before that, but um, I didn't have a guitar around the house. So um, I, I first started out with cello, and I, I tried to figure out Jimi Hendrix songs on the cello, and that didn't go very well. Uh, my, one of my older sisters had a friend up the street that had a guitar that she wasn't playing, and uh, she lent me that guitar. The guy across the street showed me an A chord, and from there I was off and running, so 12 is when it all started.
Steve Pickup and a U-Haul. This particular band has been uh, my main um, uh, performing unit since we got together in March of 2017. And uh, has my son on drums and Toby Lee Marshall on organ and left hand bass. And uh, we just actually came out with two new records, uh, which are actually going to be rele uh, released on all the streaming services next week. Um, so we just continued to uh, perform our original music, a few covers that we do in our own way, and uh, it changes from night to night. So, you know, it's it's a it's a very you know there's a lot of funky stuff that we do. A lot of it is you know it's pretty rock and roll as well as much as having you know the jazz and the blues in there as well. But uh, younger people see it and they're like, what is this? So we've been seeing people that initially come because they're guitar people and then they stay for just the music aspect of it. And, and it's been growing quite a bit. Back home, we've been, we've been touring quite a bit and we've been getting sellout crowds and you know medium level rooms. But you know, first time in New York City, we sold out the Iridium. So uh, you know, we sell out in Los Angeles and, and, uh, and down in Austin, Texas, all the, all the you know, guitar towns, we, we do well. But even you know, no matter where we go, people come out. And, and what's been very encouraging is that, as I said, they might come for the guitar, but then they, other people just come because they like the music. Right before COVID hit, we're traveling around with the band finally in the States and it's going really good. We're filling rooms, we're selling a bunch of merch. I'm like, holy, holy cow, this is really working. And then COVID hit, right? Uh, but where I was lucky was that Wildwood had me continue doing videos from home. And um, so we got to perform right in the house and tons of people watch it. So now no matter where we go, we get a bunch of people coming out that were like, hey, you got us through COVID. I'd watch your live streams every week. And so they come out to the gigs and they see us play live and like, oh my God, I loved it on the internet, but live it's so much better and yada, yada, yada. So that's really helped us quite a bit.
grazie